What's up guys, it's back here, and we are going back in with some downfall. Last time, we tried the Hexagos again, and still did not get that success. Even though, I felt like we tried very hard, and it was just not meant to be. We're going back in with the champ this time, see if we can make something work for us in our favor, because we have not got a win with him either. Okay, colorless card, random common relic, curse. For souls, or lose our starter. Uh, uh, reduce the cost of running card you have by one. Okay. Um, I kind of like our starting relics. Pretty good. Because you are entering a lot of stances. Let's see. That's not what I wanted. Um, merchant. Early merchant. Let's see. Is that a good path, though? And where's the next one? Much lower down. Okay. And then elites. It looks like there was three. And there he is. Okay. Uh, well, there's no path besides this one that doesn't have two fights to start. So we could go early merchant, remove that curse. Boom. Take this elite fight. Down a little bit farther. Question marks. Rest. Another rest. So there's two rest down here. It's kind of nice. Or if we're feeling really strong, we could go this way and then go across to down to this elite another question mark many less not even there's only the first rest there though i like the idea of getting two rests back to back let's just upgrade a card we went over here we can hit question mark come down here rest rest elite but then we don't get the shop I think an early shop. Let's see what we can get. Get some damage on the merchant. Get the souls here to do something with them. Um, we only got was that a parasite. That's not even that bad, actually. No, we might not even need the early shop though. But I still think the two elite possible path to start with is the right idea, or the two rests. Um, I think I want. I really like execute to start with usually. 16 damage to finisher to 12 benefits from increases in strength and you become choose the stance there we'll go taunt actually the ability to choose kind of helps facilitate different runs um, so like right here weakness to all you guys let's go ahead and enter berserk I think then we'll defend for three take no damage all right, then we can That's 12 so we have to strike once All right do that then we can finish him off Take damage and heal so we only get the one point of, we get the one point of strength to start with to defend and let's strike All right, um execute does not kill here Let's go ahead and hit this here. Get a second point of strength. Still not doing anything. Oh, we can just kill him here. Okay, duel. Seven blocks, seven damage. And there's only one enemy to play this twice. It's not bad. Nor that, I had to go check my wash machine was going a bit nuts. Okay, last strike. Gladiator. Six damage. Entering Gladiator. If we're in defensive, gain six counter and six block. Not bad. Um, so it's for a gladiator defensive build, and this is for a berserk gladiator build. I think I'm a fan of knives, thinking of the fighting the elites on this floor. Some AO to E damage could be very nice to start with. Okay, like this fight right here is gonna be good. Weakness to all of you. We wanted to be in this gladiator, right? Gladiator, so go ahead and prepare that up. Then we can defend very well. All right, so we're wanting fan of knives now. Yep. Boom, boom. Hits them both. I can execute one of them if I wanted to to kill them, or I could play two strikes to kill one. I can kill one and defend is the better is the better play. Kill one, defend. We take no damage. Alright, and we're prepared in Berserk. It 
matter. We just need to strike. Strategy potion. Choose a stance. Circumvent. Uh, let's see. Gain six block. Defensive combo. Gain block equal to your counter. Not great. We have nothing for counter yet. Um, that's kind of like a later piece. Enter gladiator. Pretty good. Um, six block. But this is for gladiator and uh, defensive, which we're doing berserk and gladiator kind of right now. Whenever you lose HP, you turn gain one strength temporarily. Gain one temporary strength. Uh, so this is like getting a lot of fatigue, I guess. Let's try it. I, I don't see where it's like fitting in quite yet, but I see how it could be good. I cannot apply two weak, which kind of sucks. But we still want to go ahead and enter probably Gladiator. All right. Five damage coming in, or ten damage. And knives, hit him once here. All right, berserk here. Ouch, pain and suffering. Um, okay, so I, I really wanted to play both of these, but I can't. So which is better? I th don't think it'll benefit me enough to play endless rage yet. So strike and then execute. All right. Done some more damage. He stole some of my souls. Uh, we want to go taunt, gladiator, strike, fan of knives for damage. And we did 45. Not too good, but not bad. Fan of knives, still good. Bring it on. Eh, counter's not great. This goes along with our gladiator combo that we're trying to facilitate. Also, weak is just good. So I'll go with Haymaker. All right, 366. Um, we could remove the Parasite, but let's see what all we got here. Then if you're, uh, at the start of your turn, if you start your turn, Berserk, Fatigue 2 and gain 1 energy. Not bad. Skillful Dodge is for a defensive build. Berserker Shout is pretty good. Technique, Death Blow. 10 damage to all enemies. Fatigue 10. Uh, deal damage equal to your fatigue, exhaust, and finisher. These two go really well together. Okay. I think the 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 goal would be Eternal Feather. Well, wait. Uh, Fin Blood, one Dexter Strength. Oh, that's not that great. Uh, Secret Weapon's not bad. Uh, I think the goal, though, is Eternal Feather for healing. Do Death Blow and finish him. If we can get them both. I don't know if we... Okay, we might be able to just do it, I think. Actually, we might be one cold short. 55. I think we can do... 90. I think we actually just have it. Eternal Feather. 111. Just enough. I think that's the goal. The Eternal Feather is because with doing a lot of the fatigue, we're, we're going to be taking uh, damage. Um, like losing a lot of health, so we don't want to come into a fight with low health. Um, these two go well because we're going to be taking fatigue. This is just a lot of damage in a technique. I feel like the gladiator techniques are good. So being in gladiator, uh, and then fatiguing for 10 is really good. With death blow, we draw another card, and then it works with endless rage. And the eternal feather is just the sustain, um, that I think we kind of need. Taligan, just super good. Um, we got that last time. Gives you more selections. Problem with finish him. Not good starting ter first turn. Um, okay, deal damage to all of them. I think I just want to hit the middle one. Actually, I don't want to hit the middle one. I want to hit the first one. Deal damage equally free. Yeah. Okay. Could go with a clear execute. Won't kill you, though. So I should... We're in Berserker, so we will lose all our fatigue in preserving our strength. Which would be nice. So let's execute here. Gain one point of strength. Oh, it ends our turn. That's not bad. I gotta remember that the finisher ends your turn. Okay. Um. Well, endless raid. While it's very good, at the same time, I think death blow is gonna be better for us. Eleven. Haymaker's thirteen though. E. We have no technique. We need more things to get us in different different techniques. And I'd like to block. I could just block two and play nothing else, but that seems. Kind of lame. All right. Oh, this is to all enemies. 
Definitely the right choice. Okay. I didn't realize that makes it even that makes it even better. Okay, we want to go into so this is a finisher. So what I want to do is taunt for the overall weakness. I need defense. So I'm actually going to go into defensive stance to gain 12 block. Finish him. Oh, I can just kill one of these. Actually, let's kill this one. And then what I'll do... Oh, it ends my stinking turn. That was my bad again. Because one strike kills you. Which was the goal on the last one. Uh, deal some damage there. Since we're not in the stance, the finisher does not hurt us. I, I'm remembering. Very slowly. Uh, sphere of distance at the start of combat. Three vulnerability to all enemies. Or pair for 10 max HP. I think I'll go for the vulnerability. Helps us get out some damage. Um... Hmm... I think Phantom Knives is better. 10 damage to all enemies is great, but we don't really play into defensive. Um, or we're not planning to. I'll say that. Okay, go here. Arnivore, Slimy Hat. We're going to be playing attack, so I think the hand size is better. Honestly, the Sapphire Key might have even been better there. And I think because of that, I might... Well, I could go... No, I have to go this way, and I'd not get another rest. I think I'd rather get the two upgrades. Um... Instead of taking on one more lead. Alright, let's start with... Uh, well, we only get one block. We'll do... Good gosh, our dog's going crazy. Um, death blow for 10... Well, it's one less damage. Do I really need the, the strength from fatigue to get through this fight? I'll take it anyway. Even if we don't need it, might as well have it. Because then... The, uh, the finishing will do more damage. Don't need to apply it at the wrong time, though. 14. Execute does more, I think. But it's a finisher, so... I could taunt to get the vulnerability, but he's already vulnerable. Let's actually... No, it's Haymaker, and then finish him. Yep. Got the math eventually. Uh, Berserker Shout is actually pretty good. I don't think we're doing perfected strike. Uh, yeah, so berserker shot's fine. Getting just into different positions, I think, is better. Okay, ow, ow, get the boot. Pretty good. Transform, fight, use all three heads. I think that's great. Yeah. Okay, these guys are really annoying, uh, but we have plenty of AOE. That's kind of why I was like, sure. Let's do the two defends and the, the strike. Okay, this is weird. Sword throw. Less berserk. So we want to get into berserk if we can. That's fine. Berserk. I wish there was a different one. Do some damage up to you. Fan of knives to hit all of you. Strike another one of you. Oh, transform cards. We are taking damage. <laughs> oh, man. We're already in, Zerk. Fatigue 3. Kind of get out of that. And they're doing 7 each time? You guys suck. I've not done any up there. We're down to 17, so they're doing 14. So I should defend, really. And truly. Um, this, oh, I didn't have any, was I, did I have one less energy this turn? Huh, choose a card to exhaust. I'm not going to be able to play death, that, this blow right now. Ow. Oh, man. This was the wrong move. I, I've learned that. Double your counter. Yes, let me double all the counter I don't have. We're in gladiator. Deal this twice. It's great, but the way these stupid heads work is they don't. Uh, you can't kill them at all. Like, yeah, we're we're dead. It doesn't matter what we exhaust. Cause I, though I hate that you can't just kill one of them at a time. You have to uh, kill them all at the same time. Oh well, we'll try again. 
too risky. 30 HP was not enough. It was close, but apparently I needed more. Uh, we have to do this, so. Um, go risky. Uh, uh, there are three elites. Only possibility of ever getting two of them. Uh, shop doesn't matter, so first three combats here would be free. Two question marks here would be free. Rest. Uh, one elite here, or what's the path here? This. And uh, th this. It's not really that good. I mean, like, anyway, how many rests can I get in a row? So two, three, if I go the uh, this elite path. So two, and then the starting one. Uh, actually, let's skip the first shot. Okay. Smith, I still think Taunt's the... My preferred starting smith. Go down. Yeah, get out of here. I'm scary. Iron Fortress. Whenever you enter a stance, gain two block and two counter. Not bad. Three and three. Sure. Let's let's try it. Go a bit defensively. All right. Focus defensive. There you go. Enter defensive gladiator combo. Gain six for each attack in your hand. Until you exit defensive stand techniques, grant an extra three counter. Sure. Oh, I don't have. A, oh, we have seen this one. So we can fight the Grimmel Knot for Champion's Bell, Wrist Blade. Give him up for each card in your hand. I think that's still the one I want. Because uh, maybe I'll go defensive gladiator, try to fill up my hand with cards. Sure. And they just leave anyway, so. Cloak clasp. Follow technique. Technique five times. Interesting. I don't know if I've seen that one. Gladiator shout or defensive shout. We have defensive focus, so let's grab a gladiator shout. Alright, and we're still going down this way. Don't want now with the question mark. Ooh, bonfire spirits. Okay, let's get rid of basic strike. There you go. You're disappointed, but I'm sorry. Smithy. That's pretty good. Gladiator shout draw two cards. Iron Fortress is not as good. I think Gladiator shout because for the synergy with cloak class and just to dig through our deck a little bit more. Ooh, duct tape. That's going to be... Choose two cards and combine them. Um, well, I don't know. I don't know how the putting a power with a card works. Does it become a power? I don't want to find out. I think it messed something up. Oh, the, this is weird. Because, like, we're entering different stances. Which way do they operate to? Trying to think, and I forget how it works. Does it become three cost? I could just do. This is hard. Because when I enter stance twice, does it go in which order? Hmm. Honestly, can I just put two strikes together? Make one super strike? It's not the best use of it, but yeah, two strikes. 12 damage. Let's do this. We'll enter defensive. He's dealing eight. We'll block. Gain plenty of that. Okay, we're in defensive. Uh, Iron Fortress actually is what we want. Draw two cards. We're in Gladiator now, and we dug for more attacks and did not get them. But gained six blocks from Cloak Class, which is not bad. Um, let's see. Do we taunt here? And what? But we're, I like that we're in Gladiator, but the weakness is great. Actually, taunt, defensive, and then what we'll do is execute to gain the block. 
All right. Gladiator shout, fill up my hand. Um, gain energy and stuff, but we want to play out our stuff here. So, yep, we gave a bunch from that. I'm figuring it out. And then I think another taunt. And we'll gain defensive, and then we'll execute, which I think is the kill. Yep. Uh, Gladiator shout. Oh, wait, pretty good. But we kind of need more attacks, I think. Gladiator car increases cards damage and block by two this combat. So you want to play this a bunch in a small deck? By four. Not bad. Let's do this. Alright. So we want to be in Gladiator when we play it. Iron Fortress is a great start. Oh, uh, I should have done it differently. Uh, well, something might go less. Defensive here. Weakness. This became one is what I wanted. Boom, boom. Out, block. All right. Um, Gladiator shout. Draw those cards. Precision thrust. Increase its attack. Defend became free. We're at 11. Hit him again. Okay. Precision thrust. More damage. Um, draw more cards for me, please. I can't play any of these. Well, if I change... I might if I change my stance, but those are going to uh, take energy anyway. So I'll block. That's fine. Cold Clasp is really great with Gladiator Shouts because we are filling up our hand so much. Uh, basic Strike for the wind. All right. I'm liking what we, what we got going on. Another Gladiator Slash. A Death Blow now that we have the ability. Yeah, I think so for the AoEs. It was, I felt like it was a pretty good card. And that gives us like a, a pretty good damage, I feel like. Okay, um, I want techniques. Gain four counter. Draw a card. I think I want the gladiator. Ooh, and death blow got reduced, which was kind of works out really well. Because that's the card I wanted to play. And then I guess I'll block for one. Right. Um, I'm in Gladiator already, so this will draw me three cards. Yep. Iron Fortress. Precision Thrust will not kill you. Unfortunately, I could defend for one, but this gives me three block too, so get some more damage off. Oh, and Cloak Clasp. Saving me a ton right now. Twelve to all enemies will not kill you all. This will draw me one card too, though. And the weakness will help me. So we'll do this. 12 across. Oh, we're vulnerable now. That sucks. But this should reduce a card's cost. Uh, we'll stay in Gladiator. Oh, it did not. Did not reduce a card's cost. I think I have to switch stances. Is that how it works? When you enter a stance while you're not in one. So we have to uh, make sure to finish them to do that. Okay, still, we did not take that much damage. Unless Berserk, he cannot attack next turn. I'm kind of okay with it, though. 16 damage is pretty good. The focus defensive were not really used as much, but this is adding Berserk into our combo. Which, do we want all three of them and to switch back and forth? Hmm. Can this stack, too? I don't know. I could just be happy with Haymaker, too. Weakness and vulnerability is pretty good. Let's do that. I don't want to muddle up our lines anymore if I don't have to. Oh, this is gross. All across the board weakness is less gross. Taunt here. A zero. Defend. That's fine. I actually think we don't take any damage. Pretty nice. Pretty nifty, if I were to say so. Death blows seven to all of them, which kills none of them, unfortunately. Precision thrust is even less. Iron fortress. Um, yeah, I think I just have to go with this. And then one went. Why did I take damage back? Oh, I took damage from the the fatigue. And I'm actually going to drink an ecto cooler. Glowsley armor. That'll work. Just so I take a little less damage. We're still going to take, I think, four, but. It's not terrible. Okay. 
What I can also do here is let's go ahead. Honestly, I'd rather defend, so let's focus defensive. Defend, defend. Let them hit themselves a little bit. Four more. And the counter's only on the first one. Nice to know. Ghostly armor, death blow. Killed some of them. Alright. I think I got it here. Precision thrust on you. Duct tape strike for the for the wind over there. Alright, defensive shadow. Perform X times. Trigger the technique. That's pretty good for the Lariat. I like that. Then gain energy. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Let's do Lariat. I kind of want to upgrade that. Gremlin Knob, you are going to suck. I already know. Six and that. But Cloak Clasp should help a lot here. Iron Fortress. Do I Death Blow? Yeah, I think I want the strength. That's two points of strength here. Ow. Lariat would block me a lot and I would do a lot of things, but at the same time, I'm not in any stance here. So let's go into Gladiator. Hit you here because that also weakens you. I don't really want to draw cards. And my block, I don't really want to do. Because it's going to enrage him more, of course. Another Haymaker. Pretty nice. Um, and I'm a fine getting for a block. That's fine. Take two more. Does Execute finish the job? 12 two times. Boom. Or Calc. I'm pretty good at the end of your... If you end your turn without block, gain six blocks. I don't know how these stack. So it might do nothing, which would be sad. Uh, for each card in your hand. Yeah, Crooked Strike's good uh, with the Gladiator build. Um, let's smith, I think, Lariat. If this did more strength... Oh, it doesn't exhaust, though, actually. Never mind. Pretty good. Hello. Death blow. Block. Take no damage. Um, I want to see... Well, maybe not this turn. Because they're going to hurt me if not. Do you lose three strength? And I should play that first. Actually, this just kills you. And then I want to block. Right? Or, actually, let's let's try it now. What did I gain two block from? I don't know. I wanted to see the Aura Calcumin in action. Lariat. Gain a ton of cards. Gain a ton of block. Pretty nice. Duct tape strike. Uh, I've seen a lot of focus defensive, which I've not really used as well as I should have. Um, seven block. You know, duel is just pretty good. Block and damage like together. All right, crooked strike could be good. If I was in, hmm, if I was in Gladiator, I could do some other really cool things. Let's go ahead and hit you. I don't want to get blocked if I can help it. Or do I want to get blocked? I get 10 block, or I can just see if Orc Alchem works. Let's go ahead and do it. Hit them a few times. Where did I gain four? Oh, from the stupid precision strike. Okay, I, I see what's happening. Gladiator shout. Okay. Haymaker. Now let's see. So we should get 6, 11. It does. They do work together. Okay, I really don't want to, like, use my defense if I can help it. Iron Fortress. Defensive Duelist. Because I'm defensive. We're going to block here. Ugh. Should probably use an ecto cooler. Would have made sense. Actually, lariat is actually the correct move here. Just because the fact that I'm not, um, I don't want to do anything else. Uh, crooked strike, very good. 
Oh, it is my turn too. Lovely, not what I wanted, but sure. Uh, there's the tin block I need. And then let's go ahead and actually get into Gladiator. Our build's so like all over the place. I'm still trying to. I feel like I'm still trying to figure it out, but I shouldn't be. Okay. Uh, for each technique, hits two more times. Double your counter. Does it go to one? It doesn't. Gain eight counter, then double it. I just don't know. I'm just gonna take another gladiator shout because they at least replace themselves. Okay, thirteen damage coming in. This finishes my turn. So I should do defend, defend, crooked strike, right? Or just lariat. Trigger a bunch of techniques. I'm not in any stance though. And I can't get there. If I do nothing besides just hit him with this, I would get six and then some change. Six, 11. Actually, I think that's the right move. Actually, I'm gonna do both these. And then in turn. That was the correct move. We are down to 20, which is very scary. Man, this is a weird one. Do I defensive duelist? I enter defensive, I gain no benefit from it. Um, or I could block for 10 when there's a million coming in. Hmm. Weird. Actually, here's the move. Do this. Gain 37 counter. Defend. Defend. Still could die here. I'm gonna drink another. Oh, okay. Um, Carnage. Oh, okay. Down to eight. <laughs> that hurt. Okay. I get a bunch. I only have two left though. I can make him weak. I'll gain a bunch of block from the class. I think I'm good here. Okay. How much damage are you doing to me this turn? Man, you just never, never get up. Okay, this is a finisher, so I want to play stuff before then. I actually want to do this. And then finish. 12 damage, you lose strength, I gain 12 block. I also want to persist your weakness. So let's do this. Okay. We're still struggling. Okay, this turn I really wanted to hit, be able to hit him. Here's the problem, I can't. <laughs> um, get in the Gladiator. Precision Thrust is actually great. Attack, in turn. Oh man, 76 still. Duel's pretty good here. I could Gladiator shout for a bunch. This would draw me a bunch of cards and I get a bunch of block. But what's the advantage? I need to deal damage. Rhymed. Um, we'll lose Carnage either. I think any like any of the ways I go. I'm fine with that. I think so. So this would be 14 damage. Gladiator shout. See, get all my options. Actually, Haymaker is much better. Haymaker. Well, I can't now. I need the block because I could weaken him, but that doesn't help me too much. Well, if I Haymaker, I get the six. Mori Calcum plus my hand size. Let's do that. I think that's the right move. I don't want to Lariat. Actually, I did want to Lariat to draw one card, I think. Okay, we're good. We're, besides the fact that he's dashing, doesn't matter. Precision Strike. Uh, taunt. I wish this Stained Gladiator. I wish Death Blow also was a finisher. Make it much better. I could draw another card. Does it change my perception? It doesn't. Okay. 60, 71. He's just hard to kill. Um, this is a weird one. That's a finisher. I want to do defensive. I want to strike him once. I want to crooked strike him. See if I can survive here. I'm doing fine with my 8 health. Um, duel seems pretty good here. 
Um, I could continue getting that up, but at the same time, why? I think I have to duel. So we'll weaken him. We will go into Gladiator, but, and then we will duel. Oh, and then Precision Thrust, apparently. All right. Continue the Onslaught. Draw two more cards, maybe? I think that's the play. Let's draw the cards first. It sometimes changes it, my opinion. Uh, no, it's just Haymaker. Well, actually, no. No, I need to... Well, yes. 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 Right? Yes. Alright. Because I'm like, this thing's usually blinking when it's, uh... The Orcalcum's blinking when it's active. And I was concerned. Um, Cricket Strike... Currently ends the turn like that. Do I want the defensive or do I want the energy next turn? I think I want the energy next turn. So we're going to double attack strike. We are going to crooked strike, ending my turn and game, giving us that. All right, 20 damage. Uh, I think we can do this. Duel here and then precision strike, I think does it. Yes, our precision thrust. Whew, pretty close, but we got through it. Sink so play it if you're under 50% XP, remove all de debuffs, gain 6 strength. Eh. 18 damage, deal 1 damage for all upgraded cards. Not bad. 2 damage. There's not, not a boss stun it. Deal the damage 2 more times. Cheap shot. And exhaust. So it'd be 15 for one. It's not bad. It's a finisher too, which is a cheap finisher. Let's take cheap shot. No energy, which kind of sucks. Black hole is not good. All cards are zero. Any cards entering your discard pile is exhausted. So you need a way to like, continuously refill your hand. So, uh, stop watch, lose one charge. At the end of your turn, immediately start another turn. I maintain between these starts with six charges. Uh, none of these are exciting. I think I'll take the bark to make potions better, but I'm not very excited about it. There's many other relics that would have been much better for us. Okay, early elite there. Could do two elites. Ooh, a, a, a very nice question mark path here. Four elite here. Elite. There's just not many rests though. And I could use more, like this has two, three rests on it, and an elite, which sounds awesome. And an early shop. Let's do that instead. Because we haven't smithed a lot of cards. Like Larry that I've been wanting to smith. All right. Uh, 10 damage coming right in. We could just Cheap shot ya. Uh, let's taunt. Berserk here. Uh, actually, Haymaker, then Crooked Strike. We don't get the vulnerability, but we get the weak. Yeah, let's do that. Doesn't hit us at all. And then... Gladiator Shout. Precision Thrust. Defend, defend. All right. Uh, mental Fortress, duel. It's only 10 blocks, we only need eight. Let's slowly overpower him. His block is like the worst. Okay, we are in Gladiator, so this is great. And then I'm just gonna Lariat. Get a bunch, and then we get one energy back. And then what I'm gonna do is use that energy to draw a ton more cards, just for more block, because we have no attacks we can play. Yeah, sure. All right. Uh, Haymaker, I think. And then Crooked Strike, probably. Or Duel, then Crooked Strike, actually. Duel, Crooked Strike for next turn. We're out of Gladiator. Okay, so we want to get back in the Gladiator. 
All right, defend for free. Cheap shot stuns you and gets us out of this. So strike, cheap shot, you're stunned. Okay, you still can. It's like every turn I'm just trying to I'm just trying to whittle down your plate armor. We do not do a lot of damage, which is probably going to be our downfall. Um, I want to get a gladiator, precision thrust, crooked strike. All right. And a lot of the defensive cards we put in have not been as applicable as I thought they'd be. Do duel, play that twice. Oh, we had one more from Gladiator. That's it. And then Death Blow will not kill you. Haymaker would be good though. We can keep you weak. Okay. I'm thinking Taunt, Defensive, Lariat. Get a bunch of counter. Defend again, strike you, and then you'll hurt yourself here. Okay. Then... Focus Defensive, Gladiator Shout to gain a bunch. Because I want to play Techniques if I'm in Defensive. But I'm not in Defensive anymore, so Crooked Strike would be the, the one I'd want. Okay, it's, it's a weird mix. Next time, counter activates, lose half your counter instead of removing all. Does it go to one? It does. I think just another Haymaker, though. It's kind of like my, my go-to card I'm kind of feeling right now. Hello, shopkeep. Oh, this is our first our first encounter. And I do not have, like, a ton of uh, damage I can do to you to start with. I could have went into defensive for this turn. Might have made more sense, but we're going to weaken him. Go into gladiator. Gladiator shouts to draw a crap ton of cards. Uh, Crooked Strike would be better, but we're not going to take any damage anyway. So. Okay. Then, yeah, I think I just want to... Haymaker here. Just more damage. Uh, Lariat, I guess, to draw cards. Yep. And which does it help me much? Um, we'll play Iron Forgers to get it out. Takes over more money, but we have 485. We're doing fairly well. And then Haymaker again for more damage. Precision Thrust for more damage. And he's gone. We've done did 44 damage. Okay. Add a card. The first time you use a combo return, return it to your hand. It costs zero. That's kind of nice. Does it go to one? It does. I got punch. Well, how many cards do we have combo? One, two, but really good here. You know what? We'll try it. I don't hate it, so. I think membership card, yeah. Yeah. Very good here. And going forward. Gain one strength at a random attack here. It costs zero this turn. Yeah. Another Haymaker could be nice. Gladiator style is really nice. Starting your turn, Gladiator gain three temporary strength and dex. Defensive combo. I think both these two. And I think I'll save the rest. Can't be reduced. Because another Haymaker could be good, though. We're adding them back to our hands. So actually. We'll try it. <laughs> uh, runic Icosahedron. It's fine. All right. Play the wheel. Let's see what we get. I'd like to remove a card, I guess. Or a relic. I'll take that. That's fine. Let's see what the relic is. I find Bag of Prep. Awesome. Just more cards in our hand. Which is, works in a lot of ways. Um, we have so many cards I want to upgrade. Um... Innate, this is really good because we go into Gladiator a lot. So, make sure we can see the pieces we want. Molten Egg, attacks will now be upgraded. Super good. And then I think Improvising will be next because we're if we're going to be using it, I want to be able to play it each turn. And then I'm going to continuing this way, so I'll get another. Or I could go this way and go to another shop. I get another rest. 
I just don't get this, and I can get this illegal. Yeah, actually, I'm actually much better. Cause yeah, we're doing pretty good on money. Um, okay, to start with, gladiator style gets us in gladiator. Hit haymaker, which is great. Then crooked strike, you're out of your negatives. All right, you're doing 14 in here. Um, I could just cheap shot you. Um, which work? Oh, let's do this. Ten mulligan your hand. You know what? Let's mulligan. Okay, I'm liking this still better. Improvising and then dual blocks us. So we got game 14 plus everything else. Okay, if we're start a turn in gladiator, um, well, this is a bad hand. Um, defensive, defend, and then strike. Not the best hand. Ow. I'm really not a fan of this. Cheap shot you. Okay, doing 14 here. Not as bad. Uh, taunt you. Okay, and then do this. Haymaker back again. Oh, you're so close to dead. Oh, that sucks. Another five here. Ow. Precision thrust. Haymaker. I'll say better come and I'll come back again. Uh, no. Enter Berserk. I don't want to enter Berserk. Well, do I? Because I would activate the Champion's Crown more. A Gladiator combos to bring it back into my hand to play it again, but then I won't get the Gladiator combo cause, unless I go back in a Gladiator. I'll take it and see how I feel about it. Gladiator style. Iron Fortress. Precision Thrust. Basic defense. All right, making you weak would be awesome right here, or this this does it right here. We just need three cards in our hand. So I think I'm going to improvising. Thirteen, gain three artifact, and make your move not matter. Okay. Oh, and the artifacting. Oh, that was from that though. We won't be able to benefit from that again. Uh, Duel is twenty damage here. And then that's it. Well, actually, let's go to this gladiator, make something cheaper, which was dual. And then we'll haymaker and then another haymaker. Okay. So we're in gladiator. So Phantom Ice does that, brings it back. I wanted to see if I could, uh, can I stun him and keep him here for another turn? Oh, it's my turn. I should play Phantom Knife first. Trying to leave again. I cannot get an 18, 16. Do this. Haymaker again. Lariat. And I can't do anything else. All right. Take my money and run. All right. Finn. Inner Gladiator. Has defensive, it has a combo in it. Enters Gladiator. Kind of what we need. Question cards, pretty good. Artifacts, really good. Another Haymaker. I don't think I need it. Uh, I think I will take these two. Or. No, we'll just take Gremlin Horn and a removal. And I'm going to remove uh, our duct tape strike if I can find it. Oh, I can't remove that now? Uh, oh, I thought it'd just be a waste of a duct tape. Well, I'm gonna remove our other basic strike at least. Then we'll continue on. All right, um, I think still smithing. Cheap shot, do that. All right, continue along here. Hello, snake plant. I remember I don't like you very much, but this is gonna help to hurt you a lot. Um, we're already in Gladiator. Um, that's free, so I should get any other damage I want to get in. Um, I 
think that's actually all I want to do is this. I could weaken you for next turn, but that's not gonna matter, so. Career strike in the turn. Alright, Iron Fortress, Gladiator Shout. Gain a bunch here. Gosh, you are the worst plant. I'm going to do another one, draw another card. Um, I'm going to be able to play Haymaker twice, which is nice. Why didn't it come back? Uh, blah, blah, blah. Oh, I don't have that thing I've got. Never mind. And because I have two block, I didn't get any more of that. I didn't get the power I wanted. I don't have improvising yet. I just thought I did, apparently. Gladiator combo, six tag for each in our hand. Uh, so Haymaker, oh, I don't have a pot. Haymaker again, doesn't matter. Okay. I think Execute can finish it, 20 damage. Yep. Defensive shout, Phantom Knives again. And it does come back, it's AOE. But Gladiator shouts is good. It replaces itself, it's fine. Okay. Iron Fortress is good. Gladiator style is pretty good. Gladiator Shop gets us more cards. Fan of Nice switches us to Berserk. Um, it's 15 damage, which is pretty nice. Nine. Lose 50 souls. Great. Uh, I think this is going to be better for next turn, so we'll do that. You're dealing three, we got seven, so. Okay, you're doing 12 now. Uh, we're not in any combos, so. Dual Haymaker. Okay. Improvising, okay, now we're good. So I wanna get into Gladiator first. Do I want a weakness first? No, I won't. I won't be able to. Well, either way, I either get to draw two cards and have more weakness. Weakness is going to matter more. Inner defensive repost, repost again. What repost? What did that do? Uh, oh, it just enters defensive. Yet I'd have to go back to gladiator combo. I see. And then I can Lariat here for no reason to just to draw another card. And then defensive focus, I can enter defensive. Does not matter. I have one less block. Okay. Uh, I'm already in Gladiator, so. I actually don't like this hand. Draw another card. Haymaker here. Haymaker again. Lariat, bunch of block, and I'll uh, draw a bunch of cards. I get one energy black. I can play the repost to gain counter here. Does it really matter? Yeah, I guess it does. It's the only damage I can do, so. I cannot enter that, so we'll just let it go into the deck. Oh, it's 20 counter, too. And defensive, so what we'll do, taunt, gladiator. Haymaker you, Haymaker you again, Energy, uh, do I crook it? No, with Precision, and continue. Okay, Haymaker, Haymaker, cheap shot. It's a weird, weird combination going on here. I'm very much enjoying it though. Okay, last... Stand stance is actually super good for us. Cause it's hard, it's kind of getting a little cumbersome uh, to try to get in the correct stance that I need. Um, cheap shot, I don't want one of you hitting me. I don't want to take the 13 here. Oh, I should have done my thing here. Five vulnerability, lovely. Oh, gross. Okay, this death blow, I can do a ton of damage to all of them. Let's weaken them, and I think death blow, I guess. Actually, we'll do weakness into, I'm trying to think. 
Actually, we're going to go to Gladiator. And then, because that's where we're going to want overall. Then this doesn't do it to all of them. Oh, wait, this one's one less tap, though. So actually, I could Death Blow here. I should have went defensive, honestly, now that I'm looking at like what I have. I could have defensive and then Crooked Striked. That's fine, though. You're doing a ton of damage in the back. Ouch. Okay, people. Not a fan. I'm going to go ahead and drink this now. Ooh, 10 regen. Oh, because we got double potion effects. That's actually really good. I want to kill the back one. If I can. Uh, I'm not. Uh, Gladiator Shout's going to be the first move I do. Pers Haymaker's going to be the second. Second Haymaker. Okay. Then. I Lariat here for defense. Okay. Stance, stance. I can draw another card. Enter defense. No, we'll stay in Gladiator. And then I will do the one damage back here. Gain another one. And then I kind of want to defense up now. So I'll switch into that. You guys are dealing a ton of damage still, though. But I got all these cards in my hand, so I'll gain a bunch more block. Yeah, 25 and then 10. I want to milk out this region a little bit. I want to kill this frontliner. Uh, weakness to all of you. Gladiator. Throw, well, I can execute, but I won't get any defense. Because I've already... I need to gain more defensiveness here. Uh, ooh, precision thrust actually comes back. And because of that, I do that there. We're blocked up. So I'm going to milk out this a little bit. Unless you get bad hands like this. Gross. Um, defend for 8. Hit you for 15. Okay. Defensive stance. Lariat. And I could weaken you and deal 14 damage, but I don't want you to die. <laughs> As our... Oh, I had 30. Never mind. Apparently it was. Third time you change. No, I don't want that. Um, Enter Gladiator. Berserker combo. No, I'm good. We're defensive Gladiator combo. I have one Berserk thing for the AoE. Ooh, this is a good one. Improvising here. Defend. This is a little gross. Defend. Gain a rare potion. Enter unlimited stance for two turns. Oh, ow, five damage. Okay. Uh, Fan of Knives is good. Now, if I can get back into Gladiator, which I can. Do I want to, I actually want to, no, I, I want to hit you back in Gladiator. Does it come back again? It doesn't. It's only the first time. Nice to know. Then I duel you. And now I'm locked. What does it say the first time too? Yeah, the first time. You almost could cycle it out. Should have done something else besides just stunning him there, but... Was not too worried about it. Gain more cards. Draw more cards. Precision strike, crooked strike. Um, I actually am fine with these ones. I think Flash Strike would be another good good one. Gives us more reason to enter defensive combo. Okay. Ooh, and this is the kind of opening hand I wanted. Go ahead and get everything. Most of our power is played out. It's kind of ideal. All right. I'm trying to think of how, how to, to go about this. This will end our turn. So Precision Thrust is going to be great here. Precision Thrust, again, is also great here. Stance Dance draws a card. We can stay in Gladiator here. Do I want to execute now, though? I'm at 16. I could take 8 here. Or I, I think Duel is the safer one. Might as well. 8, 5 weakness. Very much terrible. Um, okay, this would give me... Do I have a way to get back into Gladiator? I don't. So I want a Haymaker. Haymaker. 
And then repost, I guess. Well, he's not hitting us, so why not? There's no advantage to a bell player. <laughs> oh. Okay, we're gonna Gladiator. Switch gives me another one back. Ooh, he has that nonsensical thing. Um, I want to be in Gladiator, specifically. We already got blocks, so we'll block again. He's dealing 21, which does not feel good. I should have used the speed potion. But we'll be fine. But he has... Oh, he took 18 back. Um, oh, he doesn't have any more. I don't remember the name of it. Oh, he has bites, though. That feels gross. 9-9. Nine, nine. I cannot... This is going to be 11, though, so I want to use it to keep upgrading it. Oh, another precision thrust. Now that I'm, like, gaining the benefits of that, it's pretty good. You're healing yourself, which is annoying. Demon form seems really bad for me. Hey, Maker! More vulnerability, more damage. Okay. Alright, he's getting stronger, and he's using Jax, too. Um... He's, he is hitting me, so... Uh, I'm trying to think of the best way to do this. So, six counter here. Stand stance. Back to Gladiator. Or paused again. And then I could just cheap shot? But why? I want him to hit me. Hit me! And then... I should have done this first. Oh, well. Well, I, I keep it as long as I'm in defensive. So, I could just keep hitting him um yeah no reason not to and then actually gain a bunch of I want to see if the trigger take if the counter leaves and then that's it oh I keep the counter cool and then I want to do something else because this is going to be a bad turn. Strike. Get my counter back up. If I'm in defensive, I gain a block and counter. So taunt. Defensive. Flash strike. And then I could enter a defensive again. But I won't be able to play this one. He's still doing a ton of damage. Which is gross. I think I'd rather have more cards in my hand. Uh, or do I want six counters for each attack in my hand, which would be two. Or 36, I do 42 back to him. I think it's worth it. And we gain a little bit more from uh, uh, Iron Fortress. Alright, hit me. I know, that didn't feel good, did it? Alright, oh my, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> and he's still so weak and he's doing so much damage. Man, this is not great. And then Haymaker him. Haymaker him again. Oh, I think I'm gonna die here. Cause that's 34 plus 18. Yeah. I should have done the like speed potion. Well, might as well try this. What does this do? Oh, you just get all of them? Ah, uh, pain. So close. <sighs> hey, new unlocks. Let's look at those. Aggression. In enter one of them. Add a random combo card to your hand of the chosen stance. Balance. Oh, they're all the same. Those are pretty good, though. They, like, help you balance out. I would want to balance. <sighs> so close. But... Anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you did enjoy. If you did, you can hit the like button or subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time, guys. Bye.